Trump tweets to Apple CEO Tim Cook for removing iPhone home button U.S. President Donald Trump on Friday tweeted to Apple CEO Tim Cook for removing iPhone home button. To Tim, the button on the iPhone was far better than the swipe. The U.S. president wrote in the tweet, Apple started selling iPhones without home buttons with the introduction of the iPhone X in 2017. Something big has happened. Trump amid reports of Baghdadi killed by U.S. after reports of ISIS leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi being killed by U.S. special forces in a high-level raid in Syria surfaced. U.S. President Donald Trump tweeted, Something very big has just happened. The White House said that Trump would make a major statement at 9 a.m. E.T. in Washington, as per reports. The CIA was involved in locating Baghdadi. The ISIS leader Baghdadi blew himself up during U.S. raid. Confirms Trump U.S. President Donald Trump has confirmed that ISIS leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi was killed in a U.S. military operation in Syria last night. Adding that the operation lasted around two hours. Trump said that Baghdadi took three of his children into a tunnel with him and detonated an explosive vest killing him and the three children. India takes pact to world body for denying airspace use to PM. Report India has reportedly taken Pakistan to International Civil Aviation Organization for denying permission to use its airspace for PM Narendra Modi's special flight to Saudi Arabia. Overflight clearances are sought and granted by other countries as per prescribed guidelines of the ICAO, officials reportedly said. This is the second time in two months that Pakistan has rejected such a request. Russian soldier shoots dead eight fellow servicemen at military base A Russian soldier shot dead eight fellow servicemen and injured two others at a military base in Siberia on Friday. The actions of the servicemen could be the result of a nervous breakdown caused by personal circumstances not connected to his military duty, Russia's defense ministry said. Private Ramal Shamsudinov, the accused conscript, has been detained.